Hello dear kids. Today we are going to learn subtraction. In class 2, you all learned about subtraction, right? Class 3, we are going to learn some alternative ways of subtraction. Here we are going to see how we can subtract by breaking one number. Let's do these examples. 75 minus 32. We are breaking the smaller number. So we are breaking 32 here. 75 minus 30 minus 2. Let's subtract 30 from 75 first. 75 minus 30. 5 minus 0, 5 itself. 7 minus 3, 4. 45 minus 2, minus 2. 5 minus 2, 3. Since we don't have any values in tens place, we consider it as 0. So, 4 minus 0, 4 itself. So, the difference of 75 and 32 is 43. Let's do this example also. Which number we are going to break here? 54. 86 minus 50 minus 4. Let's subtract 50 from 86. 86 minus 50. 6 minus 0, 6. 8 minus 5, 3. So 36 minus 4. Minus 4. 6 minus 4, 2. 3 minus 0, 3 itself. 32. So what is the difference? 32. The second method is by breaking both the numbers. Let's subtract 41 from 85. We are going to break both the numbers. This is 80 plus 5 minus 40 minus 1. Let's subtract 80. Let's subtract 40 from 80 first. 80 minus 40, that is 40. 40 plus 5 minus 1. Let's subtract 1 from 5, that is 4. Then add these two numbers. 40 plus 4, 44. So the difference of 85 and 41 is 44. Let's do this example. 96 minus 51. 90 plus 6 minus 50 minus 1. Let's subtract 50 from 90. 90 minus 50. What is 9 minus 5? 4. So, 40 plus 6 minus 1. Let's subtract 1 from 6. 5. Then let's add these two numbers. 40 plus 5, 45. So, the difference of 96 and 51 is 45. This is how we are doing subtraction by breaking both the numbers. Now we are going to learn subtraction by making the smaller number a multiple of 10 or 100 by adjusting both the numbers. Let's do this example 63 minus 57. We are going to make the smaller number 57 a multiple of 10. We are going to add 3 to 57 to make it 60. So, we add 3 to 
3 to 63 also. 63 plus 3 minus 57 plus 3. 63 plus 3 minus 57 plus 3, 60. Then subtract 60 from 63. That is 3. 3 plus 3, 6. So the difference of 63 and 57 is 6. Let's try this example. 246 minus 98. Here we are going to subtract 98 from 246 by making the smaller number 98 a multiple of 100 by adding 2 to both the numbers. 246 plus 2 minus 98 plus 2 that is 246 plus 2 minus 98 plus 2 100 let's subtract 100 from 246 that is 146 plus 2 146 plus 2 is 148. Let's subtract three digit numbers with regrouping. 354 minus 167. 354 is 4 ones, 5 tens and 3 hundreds. 167 is 7 ones, 6 tens and 100. Let's subtract ones first. 4 minus 7. Since 7 is a bigger number, we cannot subtract 7 from 4. So, we need to borrow 1 from 10's place. So, this 5 becomes 4. 4 becomes 14 ones. So, we can subtract 7 from 14. What is 14 minus 7? 7. 7. Then we subtract 4 minus 6. This is also not possible because 6 is a bigger number. So we borrow 1 from 100's place. So this 300 becomes 200's and 4 tenths becomes 14 tenths. Then we subtract 6 from 14. 14 minus 6, 8. Then 2 minus 1, 1. So 354 minus 167 is 187. Let's do this example. 700 minus 346. Let's subtract from 1's. 0 minus 6. We cannot subtract 6 from 0. So, we have to borrow value from tens place. But in tens place also the digit is 0. So, we need to borrow from 100 place. So, this 700 will regroup into 600 plus 10 tens. This 600 plus 10 tens in that 10 tens regrouping into 9 tens plus 10 ones. So this values becomes 700 becomes 600, 0 tens becomes 9 tens, 0 ones becomes 10 ones. Did you understand this children? We regroup. 700 into 600 plus 10 tens first. Then we regroup 10 tens into 9 tens and 10 ones. Now we can subtract 10 minus 6, 4. 
that is 9 minus 4 is 5. 6 minus 3, 3. So the difference of 700 and 346 is 354. Let's subtract these numbers. 345 minus 208. 5 minus 8. We cannot subtract 8 from 5. So we borrow value from tens place. So this 4 becomes 3. 5 becomes 15. Then we subtract 15 minus 8. 7. 3 minus 0. 3 itself. 3 minus 2. 1. How do you make sure your answer is correct? You have to add this difference to the smaller number. 137 plus 208. Let's add 1's. 8 plus 7, 15. 1 carry forward to 10's place. 3 plus 1, 4. 1 plus 2, 3. So we got this sum is 345, the bigger number. So our answer is correct. We can do this also. 7 minus 4. We can do this also. 507 minus 314. Let's subtract from 1's. 7 minus 4. 3. 0 minus 1. It's not possible. 1 is a bigger number. So we borrow value from here. So 5 becomes. So 5 becomes 4. 0 becomes 10. 10 minus 1. 9. 4 minus 3, 1. To check our answer, we will add 193 and 314. Three plus four, seven. Nine plus one, ten. One carry forward to hundred place. Then add three plus one, four. Four plus one, five. We get the bigger number. So our answer is correct. Now we will do addition and subtraction together. 261 plus 452 minus 380. Let's add 261 and 452 first. 261 plus 452. 1 plus 2, 3. 6 plus 5, 11. 1 we write here, 1 carry forwarded. 2 plus 4, 6. 6 plus 1, 7. Then we subtract 380 from this sum, 713. Three minus zero, three, one minus eight. Since eight is a bigger number, we'll borrow value from hundred place. So seven becomes six and one becomes ten. Then ten minus eight, two, six minus three, three. So the answer of two hundred and sixty one plus four hundred and fifty two minus three hundred and eighty is three hundred and twenty three. Let's do this example. 219 plus 153 minus 86 plus 103. Let's add 219 and 153. 9 plus 3, 12. We write 2 here and 1 carry forward edge. 5 plus 1, 6. 6 plus 1, 7. Then add 100 values, 2 plus 1, 3. Then we subtract 86 from this sum. 2 minus 6, it's not possible. So we borrow value from 10's place. 7 becomes 6, 12 becomes 7 becomes 6, 2 7 becomes 6, 2 becomes 12. Then we can subtract 12 minus 6, 
6. 6 minus 8. We need to borrow value from here. 3 becomes 2. This 6 becomes 16. 16 minus 8. 8. 2 minus 0. 2 itself. So we get the answer till here. Then we add 103 to this number. 6 plus 3, 9. 8 plus 0, 8. 2 plus 1, 3. So the answer is 389. So 219 plus 153 minus 86 plus 103 is 389. Now let's lay subtraction of four digit numbers. Let's solve these examples. 6528 minus 3117. 6528 is 8 ones, 2 tens, 500s, and 6 thousands. 3117 is 7 ones, 1 tens, 100 and 3 thousands. Let's subtract from ones. 8 minus 7, 1. 2 minus 1, 1. 5 minus 1, 4. 6 minus 3, 3. So the difference is 3411. Let's subtract this also. 5840 minus 2630. Let's subtract from ones. 0 minus 0, 0. 4 minus 3, 1. 8 minus 6, 2. 5 minus 2, 3. So the difference of 5840 and 2630 is. 3,210. Can you try this four digit number subtraction? Thank you for watching. We will see you in the next class.